guys, this is Feeding Frenzy 91, and I'm talking about the Nintendo Direct. For those of you who don't know, there was a Nintendo Direct yesterday, and if you didn't see it, spoilers, alert, so why don't you, you know, maybe go see it, then come back, and listen to my thoughts about it. Well, there were a good amount of games shown off at the Nintendo Direct, but I'm just going to go over the ones that I really liked. Some of these were actually quite a shock, especially Kirby. Now, why was this a shock, and why am I talking about this first? Not because Kirby is my all-time favorite game, but... I don't know if you guys remember Kirby on the Nintendo 64, right? It was like an adventure Kirby game. A semi, I want to say semi 3D adventure. It was still kind of 2D-ish, but it was a semi 3D adventure, right? But since then, there hasn't really been like an adventure style Kirby game, in my opinion. Like, sorry Kirby Star Allies, but like, this one looks like a serious adventure style Kirby game, and I like that. So definitely looking forward to this one. And just like Crash, it's about time. And speaking of N64, Get this, they announced N64 games for the Switch, which is so good. I've been, I've been wanting N64 games on the Switch for a while. And not only are they coming on the Switch, but they're giving them the same treatment they gave the Super Nintendo and Nintendo games. You can play with people online. That's greatness. Imagine playing those N64 classic games online with your friends. I mean, that's pretty decent that they actually did that. They didn't have to, but they made it so you could play these games online. So... I, hopefully, like, I didn't see Mario Party on this, but I would look forward to Mario Party 2 and Mario Party 3 to be able to play those online if they were to release on this. But the games they have for it now look pretty decent. They do, I'll be honest. And hopefully we'll get some more decent N64 classics in there. Now, the one thing that seems a little fishy, though, is that it didn't seem like these games would just be an addition to your Nintendo online membership. It seems like you have to actually buy something extra to get the N64 games. Now, they didn't say a price... So that's a little fishy too, when they don't say a price, uh, you gotta be wondering why they didn't mention the price. But if it's something like an extra 10 bucks for like the family plan or even 20 bucks when it comes to at least like, you know, the family online membership, I, I wouldn't mind. But hopefully it's not too much. Then they also talked about the Mario movie. Now I'm not gonna really give my opinion on the movie itself until actually a trailer comes out. But I gotta say, some of these voice actors are weird. Like you got Chris Pat, voicing Mario, okay? I'm not even gonna mention the other voice actors, but that just sounds a little weird. Like you got Star-Lore voicing Mario. Just let that sink in. And lastly, they ended with Bayonetta, and this actually looks pretty decent. Like, I personally, I don't think I've ever played a Bayonetta. I think the closest I've gotten is to playing her on Super Smash Ultimate, but I know there's Bayonetta fans out there and they've been waiting for three, so I think this is good news for them. They say 2022, we'll see if they keep that date. Now, the direct overall was really enjoyable. The pacing was good. There were a couple dull moments here and there, but they were kind of few and far between, except for, I think, one moment where uh, there, it was kind of dull for a, a little bit, but then it picked back up, and once it picked up, it just kept really going, and they ended on a high note. So overall, this was a pretty solid Nintendo Direct. But what did you guys think about this? Did you guys like the games that were announced? Were some games that you were hoping for be announced? Were you shocked by any of the games? Like how kind of, I was kind of shocked by them announcing like a Kirby kind of adventure game. Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. May God bless you all.